Let the Hello. Hello, dog. Okay, I will share my screen to you. Just wait for a minute. Okay, you want reading, right? Uh, yes. Teacher, uh, one, one more listening. Okay, one more listening. That is date, right? Fine. Okay, date. Okay, let's continue with the date. Okay, just wait for a minute. I already opened it. Okay, I will share my screen to you. It's not responding. Okay, can you see already? Doc? Yes, I see those slides. Okay, so let's try. Start. So, our lesson for today is about the dates. So, we're already done with the time. So, let's move on with the date. So, can you describe me about date? Um, the date? Um, one week have... Uh, one week have seven days. And one month has... One month has... Uh, Thirty or uh, thirty-one days. Yes, uh, in one month there are thirty days or uh, dates or thirty-one. Special is of February as a uh, twenty like Okay. So let's have a vocabulary, okay? So please read that. Oh, fabulous. 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 Okay, we have we have vocabulary, we have fabulous, barbecue, dental appointment, 
arrive and leave, vacation and treat. Okay, please read that the meaning, Doc. And can you explain also the meaning to me in a simple English words? Can you do that? Yes. Okay. Uh, I will listen. So, tabulous is divine. Barbecue is the one time. Then, since apartment is cohen vela ram. All right, then. Live is right. Vocations is training. Chief is training. Okay, what have you understand about live? Um, live, teacher. Yes. The, when you leave home, you go out of home. Okay, very good. How about arrive? Arrive in... in Go to the hospital line. It's same, same, same. The arrive to hospital. Yes, vacation. And the vacations is the is the time when the student uh, take a rest has summer vacation. Okay. What happened? So let's practice. Match the dates on the left with the dates on the right. Okay, and they can do it. So in letter A, we uh number one, what is that? Ah, uh, number one is C, March second, two thousand one. Letter two is e, June Evans, lighting, lighting, light. Three is November first. 1992 for e, my trusty 1995 and the last five is February 28th 2003 yes very good you are correct okay number one is March 2nd 2001 number two that is June 11th, 1999. Number three is November 1st, 1992. You are correct. Number four is May 20, 1995. For the last is June 11. Oh, no, no, no. February 28, 2003. Okay, very good. So this is our calendar, okay? Yes. Please listen. Can you hear the sound? Unit 5. Dates. Page 18. 2. Let's listen. Listen to people talking to visitors. Write the date the visitors arrived and the date they are leaving. 1. Have you been here long? No. We arrived a few days ago, on the first of the month. And how long are you staying? We're staying exactly two weeks. We leave on the 14th. Two. When did you get here? I arrived on the 4th. Will you be here long? Until the 13th. Not long enough, really. Three. Did you just arrive? I arrived on July 2nd. Are you enjoying your vacation? Oh, yes, but it's too short. I leave on the 10th. 4. When did you arrive? Okay. So, did you let... Oh, not yet done. When did you arrive? 
We got in on the 5th. How long are you staying? We're leaving on the 15th. We're just staying 10 days. 5. Did you just arrive? We got here on the 3rd. And do you plan to stay long? Yes. We're not leaving until the end of the month. The 31st? That's right. Okay, Six. Oh, yes. When did you arrive? On the 6th. And when are you leaving? On the 16th. Okay, did you listen carefully? Oh, yeah. Okay, are you sure? Okay, can you answer it if you listen? Number two, what is your answer? Number one. Number one. Number one is all right. What the first and we live in party. Number two is all right. Four. We we live thirty. Number three is all right. Second. And we we'll live ten. Uh, number four, arrive five, and we we'll live fifteen. Number five, arrive third, and we we'll live thirty-one. Number six is. Rising and you live to be let's check. Okay, first arrive. Fourteen will leave. Fourth will arrive. Thirteen, ten, second, and sixteen. Okay, yes, you are correct. So this is next. This lesson. One. This is Dr. Costello's office. We're calling to change your dental appointment to August 3rd at 9.30 in the morning. Thank you. Two. Hi, Don. It's Sue. I'm calling about Cindy's birthday party. It's on July 28th at 8 p.m. Are you free? I'll call you later. Three. Hello, doll. This is Aunt Betty. How are you, darling? Listen, I'm coming to town next month, and I'd love to see you. I'm arriving on August the 10th at 11.15 in the morning. I'll call you from the airport. Bye. Four. Hi, Don. This is Ted. Listen, we can't play tennis on Saturday. Are you free Sunday afternoon, July 26th, around 3? Five. Hello, Don. This is Francis. I'll be back for my trip on Tuesday, September 22nd. Let's meet in my office that Tuesday around 6 p.m., okay? Let me know. Six. This is Star Travel. We've booked your flight to New Orleans for next month. You leave on August 2nd on flight 101 from Kennedy Airport at 2 p.m. Okay. So, are you ready? Are you done or you want to listen again? I want to listen again because it's so fast. <laughs> okay. One. This is Dr. Costello's office. We're Thank calling you. to change your dental appointment to August 3rd at 9.30 in the morning. Thank you. Two. Hi, Don. It's Sue. I'm calling about Cindy's birthday party. It's on July 28th at 8 p.m. Are you free? I'll call you later. Three. Hello, doll. This is Aunt Betty. How are you, darling? Listen, I'm coming to town next month, and I'd love to see you. I'm arriving on August the 10th at 11.15 in the morning. I'll call you from the airport. Bye. Four. Hi, Don. This is Ted. Listen, we can't play tennis on Saturday. Are you free Sunday afternoon, July 26th, around 3? 5. Hello, Don. This is Francis. 
I'll be back for my trip on Tuesday, September 22nd. Let's meet in my office that Tuesday around 6 p.m., okay? Let me know. Six. This is Star Travel. We've booked your flight to New Orleans for next month. You leave on August 2nd on flight 101 from Kennedy Airport at 2 p.m. Are you done already? Yes. Okay, let's check. Okay, number one, what is your answer? Uh, I'll go. Okay, number two. Number two is trendy is July. Okay, number, number three. three and number four is Sunday and uh, July. Number five is number five. Trendy. Okay. Okay, then tell appointment that is August 3rd, 9.30 a.m. Send this party that is July 28, 8 p.m. August 10th at 11.15 a.m. Tennis game, we have July 26th. 3 p.m. Meeting with Francis September 22nd, that is 6 p.m. And uh, the trip is August 2nd, that is 2 p.m. Are you correct? No. <laughs> no, because you did not listen carefully. Okay, what is your wrong again? That is in number... Number uh, number six. Yes. I and I'm incorrect in number. Number one, I only sign out. Yes. I don't think this is a time. So, so this is our dates. So we already dates and we have already a time, right? So if we have a date, there is a time, right? Yes. Okay, just listen carefully, Doc. Okay. One. This is Dr. Costello's office. We're calling to change your dental appointment to August 3rd at 9.30 in the morning. Thank you. Two. Hi, Don. It's Sue. I'm calling about Cindy's birthday party. It's on July 28th at 8 p.m. Are you free? I'll call you later. Three. Hello, doll. This is Aunt Betty. How are you, darling? Listen, I'm coming to town next month. I'd love to see you. I'm arriving on August the 10th at 11.15 in the morning. I'll call you from the airport. Bye. Four. Hi, Don. This is Ted. Listen, we can't play tennis on Saturday. Are you free Sunday afternoon, July 26th, around 3? Five. Hello, Don. This is Francis. I'll be back for my trip on Tuesday, September 22nd. Let's meet in my office that Tuesday around 6 p.m., okay? Let me know. Six. This is Star Travel. We've booked your flight to New Orleans for next month. You leave on August 2nd on flight 101 from Kennedy Airport at 2 p.m. Okay, are you done, Doc, or you want to read um, to lesson again? <laughs> uh, one e two, two e two, um, three e three, four e two, 
Okay, just remember your answer. <laughs> Number one, yes, your answer, yes. What is that? Mm. <laughs> so the color is confirming dance appointment. Okay. Number two. Ah! <laughs> Are you correct? Yes. Okay. Number three. Yes. Number four. Yes. Okay. Number five. Number five. Yes. <laughs> okay, so you have only one wrong. Okay. So in this case, um you got a one wrong only. Okay, you must, uh, what is that? You must focus on the listening only, okay? Because there are times also that as we listen, mm, we cannot focus or we cannot hear clearly or something that we can hear in that words, but in our mind is different, right? Yes. So that's why and we are going to answer. The answer is wrong because your ears and your mind is different okay so just focus okay are you okay for that dog okay now let's proceed okay let's practice dog one isn't it your birthday this month ted hey it was a month ago. Oh, sorry. I forgot all about it. So did you have a big party or something? No, I had to study because of the exams at school. Two. Have you had okay, your birthday no. yet, Jill? I don't see no, the it's in two months. Okay. Oh, that's right. So what are you planning to do this time? I'm going to New York with my mom and dad. Hey, fabulous. Three. Have you had your birthday yet, Sue? No, it's not till next month. Don't forget this time. Don't worry, I won't. I'm planning to have a barbecue. Great! That sounds fun. Four. Is your birthday this month or next month, Brian? I can't remember. Oh, it was a month ago. Really? So, how was it? It was okay, but very quiet. I had a family party at home. Oh, that sounds nice. Okay, so do you want to listen? Uh, okay, you can answer. Uh, one, in, one in no. Two, two yes. Three yes, four yes. Okay. What is your wrong? That is a number. Oh, teacher, Sue has has a birthday in. in okay, uh, just listen. They say that is no. Okay, just wait for a minute. One. He has the birthday in BBQ. Two. Dad. Hey, fabulous. Three. Have you had your birthday yet, Sue? No, it's not till next month. Uh, Don't forget this okay, time. That is Don't no. worry, I won't. I'm planning to have a barbecue. Great, that sounds fun. Okay, only uh, one. Next month. Yes, in next month. Yes, it is okay. Okay, now let's proceed. Okay, again and again, dog. Just listen. One. Isn't it your birthday this month, Ted? Hey, it was a month ago. Oh, sorry. I forgot all about it. So did you have a big party or something? No, I had to study because of the exams at school. Two. Okay, 
two. Have you had your birthday yet, Jill? No, it's in two months. Oh, that's right. So what are you planning to do this time? I'm going to New York with my mom and dad. Hey, fabulous. Three. Have you had your birthday yet, Sue? No, it's not till next month. Don't forget this time. Don't worry, I won't. I'm planning to have a barbecue. Great. That sounds fun. Four. Is your birthday this month or next month, Brian? I can't remember. Oh, it was a month ago. Really? So how was it? It was okay, but very quiet. I had a family party at home. Oh, that sounds nice. Okay. Are you ready to answer? Okay, number one. Answer number one. E. Number one, E, B. Okay, number two. Let me choose E, C. Number three. Number three, E, A. And number four, E, C. Okay, let's try the check. Number one is letter. What is your answer in that? Look at e. <gasps> Yes, next. Number two is go to New York's New York with her parents. Yes. That's really cute. And we have a cat family party. Okay, let's move on. Let's practice. Okay, Laya May and your B. Have you been here long? Um, no, I arrived a few days ago on the first of the month. And how long are you staying? <laughs> yeah, they are uh, exactly two weeks. We live on the party. Okay, when you did get her? Oh, I, I arrived on the farm. Okay, will you be here long? Until the uh, 30, not long and not ready. Okay, did you just arrive? Um, we got here on the third. <laughs> okay, are you enjoying your vacation? Oh yes, but it's too short. I leave and then. Okay, when did you? I live on the 10th. Okay, when did you arrive? Um, we got is on the 10th. Okay, how long are you staying? We are living on the 15th. We just stay 10 days. Okay, did you just arrive? Um, we got here on third, on the third. And do you plan to stay long? Yes, we are lost living until the end of the month. The 31st. That's right. When did you arrive? I arrived on June 2nd. And when are you leaving? Yes, let's eat you some. Where are you, dog? Are you sleepy already? <laughs> okay, just just wait for a minute. It is. Mm. Okay, so let's read together, okay? So I am one, two, three, and you are four to five, okay? Are you okay for that? One, two, three. 
I am the one. Okay, I am the one who read in one to three, and you're the one in the four to five, so that you're not sleepy. Okay, just listen. Okay, this is Dr. Cortella Sophie's. We're calling to change your dental appointment on August third at nine thirty in the morning. Thank you. Hi, Don. It's Sue. I am calling about Sunday's birthday party. It's on July 28th at 8 p.m. Are you free? I'll call you later. Number three. Hello, Don. This is Aunt BT. How are you, darling? Listen, I'm coming to town next month. And I'd love to see you. I'm arriving on August the 10th at 11.15 in the morning. I call you from the airport. Bye. Okay, are Hi, Dom. This is Ted. Listen, we can't, we can't play tennis on Saturday. Are you free Sunday afternoon, July 26, around 3? Hello, Dom. This is Francis. I'll be back from my chief on Tuesday, September 22nd. Let's meet in my office last Tuesday around 6 p.m. Okay, let's meet now. This is town travel. We book your flight to Orleans from Lake Man. You leave on August second on flight one seven nine from Kennedy Airport at two p.m. Okay. Hello, Dawn. Hello, everybody. Practice for plant. One and four point two, so we will finish this doc, okay? <laughs> okay, we will finish this so that you can sleep early now, okay? Yes. Yes. Are you excited to sleep? <laughs> Okay, I am A and you are B. Isn't it your birthday this month, Ted? Oh, hi. It was a month ago. Oh, sorry. I forget all about that. So, did you have a big party or something? Oh, no. I have to study because of the exam at school. Have you had your birthday yet, the jail? Um, no. Is in two months. Oh, that's right. So, what are you planning to do this time? I'm going to New York with my mom and dad. Hey, fabulous. Have you had your birthday yet, Sue? No, it's not still last month. Don't forget this time. Don't worry, I want. I'm planning to have a BBQ. Great, that sounds fun. Is your birthday this month or next month, Brian? I can't remember. Oh, it was a month ago. Really? So how was that? It was okay. It was very quiet. I had a family party at home. And that sounds nice. Okay. So we already done, done with our listening doc, right? So if we continue on reading, we will start only in a few, right? So better luck. We, will, we must study uh, reading on the next meeting, okay? On Tuesday. So... So we will learn the next meeting for reading Tuesday, oh. Wednesday, and Friday you will study for writing. Do you want that? I think we will study listening. Listening again. Yes. So we are going to study listening so that you will enhance your listening skills. Yes, um, my mother wants me to put a listening and speaking. Ah, no, speaking. Okay, so listening is speaking is your weakness. 
right? So you must be steady in listening. Okay. So in listening though, don't worry why. Because in listening, you will need to listen. So listen the sound. Um, understand on what you are listened or on what you are heard. Example, we have an announcement, right? So in announcement, the best important is you will get the only the important only the important words example um, if you listen you will need to um get the important words or while you are listening this is the first step while you are listening you can write also do you know how to do that listening while writing do you know how to do that so in our in our high school life doc um well we listen to our teacher example we have um a paragraph um the teacher will read you a paragraph so in a paragraph you must need to listen because after listening, there is an exam, right? Yes. Okay. So, if the teacher will read, so you must first to do is you will get your pencil or ball pen and paper. So, while you are listening, you will write the important words. Did you understand about that? Uh, yes, uh, we also use for remember some pages when you write the uh, important words. Yes, that is true. If the teacher will use a books and you have also a books, so if they read, okay, you must follow also. While you are listening to him or her, you will follow also what he or she read, right? So, after that, if you are focusing in listening or you are focused in um, on what you are heard or in what you are understand on what the teacher said to you or read, read to you, so it means after that, you can answer easily. Okay, for me, Doc, in listening, um, my best thing to do is I will listen or focus. I will listen and focus and write. That's it. That is the very important thing to do in listening. Listen and write. So that after you are listening, you can remember because you have a writing words. Example, if you cannot remember that word, oh, what is that? Mm -hmm. So, you will look your notes, right? So, you can easily remember what you have heard. So, what if you are only listening? So, example, doc, you are only listening and no other doing. So, if you are only listening, sometimes if we just listen only, we cannot remember. Did you experience okay. that? Did you experience? Yes. yes. So, when, when I listen, I must write the answer in words. Yes. I forget that. Yes, that is the best thing to do in listening. Okay? Even though do you have a mistakes or a wrong in exam, uh, that is exam for listening, but it is okay. Why? Because not all the time, docs, you are very correct or you are perfect in that time. Because there are times also you cannot remember. You can only remember after exam already, right? So, that is the tips for you. So that um, um, you won't worry about listening. So, that sometimes listening exam is very hard, okay? Because there are times the teacher 
will read to you in a faster way. Did you experience that? That the teacher will not explain. They will always read, right? So it's up in the students if they listen carefully, right? Yes. <laughs> So, just remember my tips to you, okay? And that is in listening. Okay, and speaking also, um, if there is someone who are, uh, what is that? Who are speak in the front of you, just only focus. Just only focus also. And you will remember the important words. Just remember important words only. Right? So, if you want to be a good speaker, Doc, okay, just remember, you will always read a books. After reading a books, you will practice in speaking all day in English language, right? Because sometimes, Doc, reading is very helpful in speaking. Why? Because in reading, you will enhance your comprehension skills. So, it means if your comprehension skills will enhance, so the speaking is the last problem. So, the best thing to do is reading and practice. Okay? That's it. Reading, practice, and speaking. And listening, you will write and focus in listening. Okay? Just remember what I've said to you, Doc. <laughs> okay. Do you have any question? That's all. Okay. You can question me, Doc. You can ask me anything you want. Or you can ask me if you cannot understand what I've said to you. Or you can you can ask me um to help. Okay, don't be shy to hesitate to ask me, okay? Don't be shy to ask me. A teacher. Yes. In your country, uh, it's the summer, isn't it? What is that, Doc? If it is summer? It is summer. It's in really? In, in your country, it is summer. Oh, no. Now is not a summer. Oh, okay. Our summer is only March. Oh, no, no. Our summer is April and May only. There is two months. So, these demands serve so, uh, uh, Today, August. August, September. October, that is not the summer. So, j okay, just remember in, a, in our place or in our country, Philippines, January is our new year. That is our new year. Do you know about Never new year? January. That is a January, a month of January. Yes. Yes, February. Ibilam has also New Year. Yes. Yeah. So what month? Um, February. Okay, February. So our February is a month of hearts. <sighs> yes, our March here in the Philippines is... That is a fire month. Do you know about fire month? Fire month. Yes, that is a fire prevention month. Burning fire. That is our March. Our April. Yes, our April and May is the summer. Our June. Um, our normal June is our come back to school. June. That is our June. come back to school. But now we have no school. We have no the the, uh, the students are not studying oh, in school. In the lamb, we um finish and has the summer vacation in we we have the 
we start the summer vacation in the July, ah, June, and we start to do uh, uh, school at eight uh, hour, hour. Okay, so in our August, September, October, November, that is our normal month. So December is our Christmas month. And in the lambs, there are four seasons. Okay, so the four season is winter, spring, autumn, and what is that again? Summer. Yes, winter. Spring, autumn. Spring, autumn, spring. summer, and... Okay. Winter, winter. <laughs> <laughs> so, today, Doc, what grade are you? Are you in? Uh, I, uh, after this uh, summer workers, I will, I am going to seventh grade. Okay, you are second grade already. So, wow, congrats. <laughs> just remember, just always study, okay? I am happy to be your students. I am happy to be you as your teacher, and I also I'm happy to be my student. Right? Because you are so clever, and you can easily understand. You can easily, um, what is that? You can easily explain, or you will accept, um what you what you are or you will accept that you are wrong so that is the best thing to do though you must accept everything right because we are not far back so if sometimes though um if you think that in your exam you are perfect and then you got a example too wrong or two mistakes so you will accept that okay even though you are always studying there are times also that you made a mistake mistake is not always if you will what is that if you can easily handle your mistake right okay so do you have any question doc Teacher, do you study at uh, university? Mm, no. Um, here, our university is that is very far. Why? Um, now I am in the other place. In our place, um, when I was um, single or not yet married, um, our school is not university. That is a normal school because we cannot afford to study in a university. Why? Because here, Doc, if we say that university, that is, um, that is a very rest or that is a very, what is that, expensive already. Our parents cannot afford to go to school if you will go to university yes and also yes and also i cannot experience in what is that in a private school why because our parents cannot afford also so that's why we are in only in a school that we can afford yeah and I, teacher, if yes. you want to go to university, you must do a exam. Yes, that is very true. If you have, if you are in university, you must take an exam. If you can pass, so it means you can go there. If you are failed, sorry, you cannot enter in that school. So in university, it's very young. Uh, it's very hard. Yes. And in the lambs, there are many, uh, it's so, it's very hard. So many rich family give the money for the teacher 
em giờ thì chờ biết giờ giác ở giờ theo sẵn giờ university yes anh nghĩ anh nghĩ là corruption yes so dog mm, i will say to you even though um university is not uh it's not that if we say we are schooling in university we are too low just remember that university is just only um what is that a pride why because in our university most of the students are rich just remember that most of the students are they are comparing each other right did you experience that so for me um i don't want to study in your university why because there are times that um we cannot remember of being who of being what we are so example we are very for poor in our family so if you are going to study in university what happened to you so in the students in university they are always comparing right okay example the students will say i have new shoes i have new dress i have new bag i have new gadget so what if you are studying in university and you don't know uh, you don't have about that so what happened to you are you shy? are you shy with that yes so that's it so that's why i don't like in university because that is the time if we cannot buy or we cannot afford in what we want what happened to our parents they are very pity why because our parents will do their best so that we they can give um to us if what we want right so being a good student or being a good son or a good daughter in our parents just remember be who you are be what you have right be contented of being what you have in your family that's it that's only the just only remember um if the other classmates um example they have many gadgets and you know so don't compare don't compare with them because they are rich and maybe we can afford for that but we just imagine our parents right um yes but doc are you you are a rich kid right so you are studying in a university no i am not a rich <laughs> oh you are a rich kid okay so just remember doc even though you are a rich or you are a poor so be contented just only be contented be contented of what you have be contented of what parents will give to you okay don't ask many things in your parents why because not all the parents doc are can give us um what is that what do what we want right because our parents will always have a problem also but we don't know we, we don't know it because they will not tell us right so being a son or a daughter you will we will always understand to them right because they always do their best just to make us happy or just to make us alive or just to make us to go to school right <laughs> yes so just remember on what i am said to you doc because some someday you will realize that oh teacher is very true so i just remember with her, with her on what they are on what she is saying right 
just always find a way or that is, what is that? That is act as a normal or act as being who you are on the dock. So example, you are dock now, so you will act as dock on the future. <laughs> don't, okay, don't be changed. That's it. And be responsible. And what is that? The best thing to do is you must adore your parents. Okay? <laughs> I hope you uh, I hope you learn many things today though. Okay. So it is already time. Are you sleepy already? Oh. <laughs> oh, Duke, you must sleep early. Oh, that is 10 o'clock in Vietnam time, right? Um, yes. Yes, here is, um, we are going to 11 o'clock already. We are advanced in one month. Um, no, one month. In one hour only. <laughs> We're advanced in one hour. So, for me, um, 11 is my sleepy time. Why? Because I have no class already. I have two student, students only in Pantado. You and another student. Green. Oh, so, uh, yes. I'm of those students. What, what grade is he? Uh, that is um, grade one, level one, right? Oh, what is that? I just wait. I just, I, I forget. <laughs> that is um, level two. That is... What is what grade is that level two? Um, grade. Hmm, that is only a level two doc, but I have a students like um I have a student also last, um he is already um grade six also, or oh, okay grade six. And he is also a Cleaver student. His name is Harry. Harry. Yes, Harry. Um, he has no English. What is that? He has a uh, English. What is that? Um, uh, he has English name. English name. Oh, that is an English name, Harry. Harry, just wait. Hmm. That is his English name. Okay, I will forward his name if you know about him. Hmm, it is loading. Grade 6 or I think grade 5. Piki eleven. That is that is Piki eleven seventy three. Okay. <coughs> it is loading. Grade seven. Okay, his name is Harry Jiki HDN. What is that? Yes, wait. I will read the Vietnam name. His name is Okay. Vu Nguyen Pong. Do you know yes. that? I know. No. Vu Nguyen Pong. Vu Nguyen Pong. A Phương. Vu Nguyen Phương. Did you know that? Did you know him? No. I think he lived in different province. Maybe he is different place, right? 
but okay so did you know this okay that is my only students that um the same with the, your age the other are too young okay dog it's already time you can sleep now <laughs> Bye, goodbye oh you have a brother bye hello little boy <laughs> <laughs> good night good night dog good night little boy bye 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 bye, bye. <laughs> good night, okay good night